never get away with killing my child. never get away with killing my child. Their love for their sons unrelenting, just like their pursuit for the truth. I want him to admit the truth in my face. But finally, a sense of relief less than a week after Detroit mothers Natasha Hart and Sharice Ali told their story on Fox 2. Charges finally filed against the man accused of killing their sons, 30-year-old Raynard Harris. It gives me a peace, you know, to know that our story is being heard. Harris arraigned on two counts of reckless driving causing death and two counts of driving on a suspended license causing death this week for the horrific crash that killed 19-year-old Trey Taylor and 17-year-old J. Mink Ali Johnson back in February. That you just hit our children and left them. And maybe if you would have called the police, they could have been saved. Detroit police say someone now believed to be Harris blew through a yield sign near Savage and Cary on the city's east side and slammed into the SUV the teens were in so hard it smashed into a vacant home. The mothers say witnesses reported the people in the car, including Harris, called someone to pick them up and then claimed to be innocent bystanders. That's cold-blooded.